Hello guys, today I'm here to talk to you about Viva Las Vegas. So I don't know if you guys are ready or not, but I have some tips for you if you're not. For you guys coming for Viva Las Vegas for the first time, um, how does the event work? It's four days, so Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I divide the days in two parts, day and night, of course. So I prepare myself with two outfits a day. I'm gonna put some pictures here so you can see examples of day and night outfits that I uh, wore for the last, the past year. Um, so if you're wearing original vintage, make sure you pack some extra outfits just in case something happens because you don't want to walk around and something happened to your dress, you ripped, there's a hole, you're missing a button so make sure you pack some extra outfits if you're wearing original vintage so um, I would normally pack two outfits a day day and night as I told you but I have to have in mind that on Saturday we have the car show and for the car show you want to wear something really light something light and flowy because it can be super hot super sunny and windy so you want to wear something that you're gonna feel comfortable with something that's not gonna give you weird tan lines because of the Sun and that will bring up some of the items that you should bring with you. Also, don't forget the pool party on Sunday. I don't know, you can go for the pool party any of the days, but Sunday is the day that they have the swimsuit contest, so I always go on Sunday. So make sure you pack your swimsuit and a towel for the pool party. So, number one, dry shampoo. If you're doing the whole experience, you're gonna need a dry shampoo. Why? Because you're gonna do your hair for the day, and then you can just freshen up a little bit with a dry shampoo, and you're ready for the night. Just restyle it a little bit, and you're ready. If you don't want to wash your hair for the next day, you can do the same thing. I normally wash my hair at night, and I curl it again every day, but it really depends. If I'm feeling really tired, I might just go with a dry shampoo. Uh, number two. Number two is hairspray and pomade. You're gonna need a hairspray because Vegas can be very, very, very windy and you don't want your hair to move or your hairstyle to just fall. So bring an extra whole hairspray for it and pomade because as you can see, you can get rid of the flyaways. With a pomade. Number three, sunscreen. Yes, you're in the middle of the desert, you don't want to mess up your skin. So bring a very, very good sunscreen, something that matches your skin type, and make sure you don't forget the sunscreen because you don't want to have weird tan lines in your body. Especially if you're coming for the car show. Because I know some people will come just for the car show, some people uh, don't even go to the car show. But if you're doing any outside activities during Viva, bring your sunscreen. If you have one specific for your face, bring that one too. So number four, lip balm. Don't forget your lip balm because, as I just said, it's really dry here and you don't want your lips to be all dry and hurting or bleeding or anything like that so just bring your lip balm with you if you forget it just run to the closest store and get one uh, the other thing that you might need is a nasal spray it's very dry here most people will get nosebleeds on the first couple days so um, don't forget your nasal spray if you want to breathe Number six, 
Uh, number six is moisturizer. Make sure you bring moisturizer and put it all over your body at night because it's super dry in here. You don't want it to look all ashy and weird. Um, also, it can hurt a little bit if it's too dry. I have a companion here to help me with the list. So, bring your moisturizer so you can have skin beautiful like me and my baby. I'm kidding. This is makeup. It's not moisturizer. Um, number seven is very, very obvious. I don't even believe that I have to say this here. But, right? She agrees with me. Bring deodorant. Please, dude. You're gonna be dancing, you're gonna be walking, you're gonna be talking, you're gonna be doing everything you can during Viva. And it gets super hot when you're in Vegas. It's hot. So bring your deodorant and be nice to your friends that will be sharing the space with you. Number eight. So number eight is comfy shoes. I know you girls will want to match your shoes with your outfit, but make sure your shoes are comfortable. Make sure you pack an extra pair of flats just in case you're walking around, you get tired of your heels and you can get blisters. So make sure you have very, very, very comfortable shoes. Which bring us to number nine. Number nine is band-aids. You can get a cut, you can get something else, but band-aids is specifically for blisters. Um, I had a very, very bad experience on my first Viva. I decided to wear uh, heels on the first day and my feet just killed me for the rest of the week. So don't do that. And if you want to wear heels, make sure they are comfortable and you can walk around with them with no problem. Or make sure you're just gonna sit at the alligator bar and drink a lot of drinks and talk to a lot of people. And you're not gonna do much walking because if you will and you get some blisters, it's gonna ruin your whole weekend. So make sure you have number eight and number nine. Comfortable shoes and band-aids. Number ten. Number 10 is extremely important. Bring something for your hangover. You don't want to wake up on the next day extremely hangover and miss the pool party or miss the car show or miss a band that you were wanting to see or miss the fashion show or miss anything. So make sure you have something for your hangover so you can have fun, you can drink, you can be all over the place. That brings us to number 11. Uh, make sure you have some headache pills and something for muscle pain or, you know, just be prepared. Bring a little bag with your medicines, things that you normally take, uh, vitamin C maybe, I don't know. Just make sure you are prepared so you can just have fun the whole weekend with nothing getting on your way. And number 12, and most important item of our list, water. Make sure you drink lots and lots and lots of water, especially if you drink alcohol. You don't want to get dehydrated, you don't want to pass out in the middle of the car show, you don't want to ruin your friend's night because you just passed out, you were dehydrated, you're having a headache or something like that, so make sure you drink lots and lots and lots of water. Even if you don't drink alcohol, just make sure you are hydrated because we are in the middle of the desert and it's gonna make a total difference on your weekend. So those are my tips. I'm gonna put the list down here so you don't forget any items when you're packing and make sure you subscribe on my channel. Also make sure you follow me on Instagram. I'll be posting the video on both IGTV and YouTube and Make sure you are ready for Viva and come here to say bye. Bye. Well, she's mad as hell. <laughs>